Hello everyone and welcome back to the Atletico Madrid career mode. This is season two, the start of another season at Atletico Madrid and hopefully a very successful season indeed. Last season we won the Champions League, we finished second in the league. Um, unfortunately not to win the league by a point. We were one point away from Barcelona but that just shows the quality in this team and we're going to improve this team even further and try and win even more trophies. Okay guys we have our pre-season tournament invite let's advance with that and we're going to pick the one that has the lowest quality opposition in it and we're probably going to pick uh, that one. My second team have to play the pre-season because I don't want any injuries that's just the way it is really. Anyway let's take a look at the board objectives for this season they're pretty much different to last season so overall we have to finish with a profit margin of 63.7 million and we're already three percent on the way of doing that and we have to gain 117 million from shirt sales and we have to win the champions league again so for the youth development that is medium we have to sign one player slash players to the senior team in the same season they were scouted play them in 10 matches either as part of the starting 11 or as a sub okay that should be easy then we have to sign two players with potential over 75 to our youth academy and increase the overall rating by 10 okay that sounds pretty reasonable um, 170 million from shirt sales of course financially the profit margin 63.7 million and then our domestic success is to win the league and our Spanish Cup objective is to win that Okay, I should reach the final, but I intend to win that anyway. Then we have to win the Champions League. So those are all the objectives. A bit different from last season, since we had a lot of success last season. They expect even more of us this season. So the four players we have on the transfer list are Valcarez, the centre back, 23 years old. Um, he's on the transfer list because even though he can reach 80 rated, he's never going to get into this team ever. We have four very, very good centre backs, so he'll be sold. Mensa, he's 22 years old, 74 rated, we have players way better than him, we have youth academy players who will be better than him, even though he's potential of 80 again, we are going to sell him, Sequeira, 31, 77 rated, really poor, so he's going, and Miranda, 85 rated, yes, but he's not an athletic in real life, so we're getting rid of him, Vaz, Hernandez, Cravita, Gonzalez, Thomas, are all on the short term loan list, while Bernard, Dibiar and Borea are on the one year loan list. Now we do have a few players retiring and these two are Torres and Gabby. The two 33 year olds are retiring so I can't do anything with them um, which is a shame um, but I was never going to sell Torres. I would have sold Gabby maybe but they're going to retire and that's fine by me. Okay guys, so a good way to make money off transfers would be to bring in a massive midfielder. And literally, I mean a massive midfielder. And I mean William Carver Howe. He is my first choice target for this transfer window. What a player he is. I do not know how he has not been picked up by any other club in Europe. How is he still at Sporting Lisbon at the age of 24? He should have gone last season. It's absolutely ridiculous. Um, 86 rated. He is a, he is the defensive midfielder we need. I know Sal took over the defensive midfield role from Gabby, and we were so much better with him in it. We were so much better with him in it. Um, but he's 83 rated, and we need a world class midfielder alongside Koke. Now, Sal has the potential to reach that, but Will and Carl Howe is already there, so we're going to make a bid for him, and mm, we're going to go in with a. 40 million pound offer first just to test the water and see how much they want exactly okay guys first off we have a transfer offer for Miranda 15 million from Man City now he's 85 rated 32 years old but he's got more value in him I'm going to counter offer 20 million pounds exactly and um, because yeah he is a pretty good defender still even at his age so Man City have to pay a bit more we then have a loan offer from Granada from Gonzalez. 
He is our best youth academy player at the minute, 68 rated, 17 years old, and a short term loan to Granada in La Liga would be amazing for him and for his development. So, definitely going to accept that. Okay, guys, Sporting Lisbon wants 63.5 million for William Carvajal. Um, we only have 23 million. I could pay 60. Actually, I could pay 63, but that would ruin our budget. So I'm gonna go in with. Mm, let's go with 50. Okay, guys, we arrive at the first preseason game against Jean Book. I have no idea who they are. Absolutely no idea. But the second team is going to play them. Let's hope they can smash them. They do. 5 0, 2 for Korea, 2 for Visagico, and 1 for Williams. Brilliant victory. Okay, guys, we've had another transfer offer from SD Abar for Sequera. 3 million, but it's worth 4.3, and I want 5 million for Sequera. I think that's pretty much fair, um, considering Abar are a pretty decent team and they have quite a bit of money on them, I think. So, yeah, and he's still a pretty decent left back, to be honest. Transfer offer for Jose Jimenez. From Real Madrid, our arch rivals have come for one of our best defenders. And I'm just going to say, no way. Man City have replied to our transfer um, counter, 18 million. Mm, you know what, I'm just going to accept that. We do play Man City next actually in the preseason tournament, but I'm just going to accept it because they probably will not offer 20 million for someone who is quite old really. Big news guys, that 50 million offer worked to perfection. We have had that accepted. Will and Carver Howe, we're going to offer him a contract £35,000 a week. We're going to give him a four year contract and then a crucial first team player role. Okay, we arrive at our second preseason game. Us and Man City are on three points, so this could be an early group decider. The second team will, of course, play again against Man City. Hopefully, Man City play weakened team. Which they have not done. But we still win 2-0 against them. Phenomenal. Well done. Jolta and Vysajko. Vysajko got three goals in two games. But we've won. Excellent. Okay, guys. Miranda has been sold for 18 million. We have 15 million added to our budget. That's good. And SDA Bar replied with an offer of 3.4 million, and I'm just going to accept that. And yes, guys, we have got transfer business done early and we have secured a massive signing in William Carver Howe. We still have 30 million thereabouts left with the sale of Miranda, and Sequoia will even add to that. But welcome to the club. What a player we have signed. William Carver Howe, what a beast. Alright guys, we arrive at the last pre-season game of our pre-season group and it's against Tottenham who are on 3 points and we're on 6. So the second team will of course play again. Let's see if we can get another victory. Which we do, 2-1, another victory. Vieto and Correa scoring goals. We qualify as group winners. Sequoia has been sold to SD Abar for 3.4 million, 2.6 million added to our budget. That's good. Um, we've just got some money for the pre tournament and we have two transfer offers one from Real Sociedad for Vasquez, 3.8 million quite happy to accept that and then the second offer is for Cravita a short term loan offer from Leon and I'm quite happy to accept that Cravita and Thomas are going out on loan to make way for William Carver Howe we've had another two transfer offers Another one from a direct rival, Barcelona, have come in for Koke. They have been linked with Koke a lot in the past. 43.5 million. That is a very nice offer from Barcelona, but yes, again, I am refusing everything. And then another offer for Mensa from Deportivo La Coruña. 3.1 million, and I'm quite happy to accept that as well. Okay, we arrive at the semi-finals of the Champions Trophy preseason tournament against Inter Milan. The second team will of course play this again. Can they win? That's another question. 
We do. We go through 5-4 on penalties after Williams and Jovetic scored. Okay, we're through to the final, unlike we were able to do last season where we got knocked out by Borussia Dortmund, I believe, here on penalties in the semi-finals. Ben Immense has been sold, guys, to Deportivo for 3.1 million. And Valcoez has been sold for 3.8 million to Real Sociedad. So we have sold, I believe, everyone we wanted to sell. Here we go, oh, guys, the pre-season final. Against oh, Bayer Leverkusen, a very good team by Leverkusen. I think they're one of the best teams in Germany, especially with the players they have. Hernandez, Tananoglu, Jonathan Tarr, Bernd Leno. The list is just endless with the number of incredible talents they have in their team. So it's the final. They beat Man City in the final 2-1. Um, we beat Man City, of course, as well to get to the final. But um, it's going to be our first chance to check out this team. We're playing on Legendary as well for the first time in season two so we're going to take a look at how difficult the game will be if it's really super difficult and we lose like heavily then i'll switch down to world class again for the european super cup final against man united of course which we have um, in a few weeks time after this game but let's get into the game and see how william cobb how does it on his debut of course quite a few changes for bayer leverkusen but can't do griezmann Gaitan, Gaitan, first sure effort, well was, wide. Make a chance with this tackle. Holland, oh, good block, got in, right to oh, black. With this attack. Tanoglu, well wide. Carrasco, oh, brilliant ball. Positions. Here is Kevin Gamero. What a finish by Kevin. 29th minute, Kevin Gamero breaks the deadlock. What an overlap this was by him. Carrasco, brilliant ball. Gamero runs in, uses his pace. Cross body, finish, hits the post, goes in. Great strike by the 30-year-old. Made it 1-0. That is our first chance on target. Oh, what a pass. No! Oh, whoa, what a miss! What a miss by Richards. Oh, no, Chananoglu. Oh, Bellavi. Over the bar. Kevin Gamero. Plays on to Carrasco. Carrasco, Gamero! Oh, shoots wide. Oh, deflected, actually. Carrasco. Carrasco can shoot! That is a poor effort, Carrasco. Charnoglu just passed the post again. Kovahau, no! Oh, Benaravi misses again. What a mistake that could have been. No, Volland! Oh, it was coming. It was coming. One all now. Like no God! I can't believe I messed that finish. pass up. Well, one team is very happy here, and one what team a strike is very from frustrated. And yet, oh, Black, no chance. One all. Kind of gap between these two. Short passes, Whoa, Bellarabi, no. Bellarabi, what a save, oh, Black. Oh, Coria. Vieto, Vieto, come on. Use the pace. Use that pace. Penalty! Yes! Jonathan Tarr brings down Vieto. That is a red card. That has to be a red card, right? Send him off, ref. Come on. And a red. Clear goal scoring opportunity for Vieto. Jonathan Tarr, really good defender. Brings him down. It is a penalty, but I am shipped from penalties, as we know. So I'm not going to really show how I'm going to be able to score this. Vieto. Yes, he does it. I've done it. It worked this time. And Vieto scores the penalty. Fantastic chip. That's the only way I can score penalties. Really decent power. Hit the line as it went over. Very nice. But Bern Leno dived the wrong way. And it's 2-1 Atletico in the final. 
guy's trying to get in there. Koke. Naki. Wan Fran. It's a good cross. Vieto. What a header. What a goal scorer he is. Penalty and header. What an impact from the bench he's had. Wan Fran. What a cross. But what a header into the far corner. From Vieto. Leno. No chance. And it's 2 2 1 is 3 1 Athletic Chemistry. And there we go, guys. We've won it. We've won the pre season tournament. What a confidence booster that is ahead of the start of the season and the European Super Cup. We defended really well, um, apart from the goal, of course. That was pretty, pretty shit. That was that goal. But anyway, we've won the first piece of silverware, technically. It doesn't really count. But it's a piece of silverware, uh, nonetheless, and it was an objective to win the Champions Cup pre-season tournament, and we have done in some style as well. And Wanfran will get to lift the trophy. Here we go. Pre-season tournament winners. Absolutely brilliant. Brilliant start. Real, real, real good achievement ahead of the start of the season. And uh, William Copper House did perform quite well in this game. We should have kept the clean sheet, but Vieto, what an impact from the bench. Penalty and header. He could be something this season, Vieto. I know I criticised him at the beginning of last season um, in the squad report when he was alone Sevilla, but he did prove himself to Sevilla. He scored 12 goals and um, was crucial for Sevilla. And um, he wants to prove himself to me here, and he's doing that so far. So the game as a whole, we had two shots on target apparently, which was um, technically correct, because we actually hit the post with the first goal. Leverkusen had two shots on target. We have more possession, it was a pretty drab game to be honest. Vieto was man of the match, even though he came on as a late sub. But what a way to end this episode. Okay guys, that's the end of the episode, a very good episode and a very good start to Season 2. Winning the pre-season tournament in the way we did and signing William Carvajal. What a signing he should be for this team in the coming weeks of the season. Hopefully he can prove himself and hopefully he can win many trophies in this season. This will be the last season of Atletico Madrid um, and then new career will start of course, but hopefully we can have loads of success in this season if you do have any transfer suggestions we have how much money do we have i think we have a lot of money left still i won't bother checking actually i know we have a lot of money left we sold quite a few players so we have a lot of money so if you have any suggestions for any players you want to see in the career mode let me know and i'll see what i can do and see if they actually fit into this team because the team is looking very very strong in numbers we look very good and our players are just quality through and through. Hey guys, if you did enjoy the episode, please leave a like and please subscribe to the channel for more Athletic Madrid Criminal content. We hit 50 subscribers thanks to last season. Let's try and get to 100 subscribers in this series. At the end of this series, let's try and get to 100 subscribers. That is the aim now, 100 subscribers. Hopefully we can get there. Hey guys. Please share my videos with your friends. Let's bring even more people to the channel, and I'll see you in the next episode.